Hey Insiders, Daniel Pickett here once again on your Soggy Week here on AFI-TV. Thank you so much for tuning back in and watching. We've got another great product here from Playmates based on the Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles animation. There's a nice uh, arc coming up with uh, everyone's favorite samurai rabbit, Usagi Yojimbo, that is going to be coming soon where he interacts with the turtles. I'm greatly looking forward to it. My DVR is already set and... Uh, we previously looked at the the four inch guy that's just in the his standard you know what we know is his regular costume and then this XL figure that is a Walmart exclusive. Now we're going to take a look at Usagi in his samurai armor, and this one he's not even on the the back of the package, so some folks might even know he exists. But a uh, very cool figure, ties in well with, you know, uh, what you know, we have the other four turtles also in samurai armor. It's got a great dragon face to his helmet there. And uh, we'll crack him open. Let's see, see what we, what's what with this version. We can compare him to the other standard version too. So he's got a, an alternate head that has his ears laying down. You can see we can compare the two right here. Alternate head sculpt then for that. The scabbard fits right in on there. He's got mostly the same articulation it feels like as the standard figure. He's got the swipe ball. This one's got, feels like it's got a little more ball movement than even the other one actually. Shoulders, full rotation, ball jointed. Also for elbows, full swivel and swing, rotating hands. I'm gonna take that off for a second. Uh, yeah, the hips can't move as wide out just because he's got this rubber armor on. Still has a little bit of knee, but again, you know, these pants and the knee pads do prevent a little bit of that. Does not look like he turns at the ankle though, so. There's that. Let's see, the swords fit in the scabbards like we saw with the standard edition. Right there like that. And then that all snaps back on his belt. And then he's got this mask. Let's see, this is all one piece. The turtles, I think, uh, well, is it? Yeah, that looks to be glued on there. The turtles uh, actually have two-piece masks, so you can take that off. It's got a great sort of dragon face there. And you put it all the way on, it actually lines up with his eyes. There's another variant of this exact costume, this exact figure, that is in the Walmart horse set. It's basically repainted. We'll be covering that later in the week. So tune back in and you can see that deco as well. So, uh, you know, here he is with the helmet on. You can actually line the eyes up, which is kind of a, uh, a spooky look to him, that dragon mask that he has on. And with the helmet on, you almost can't even tell it's, uh, it's the same figure. It masks so much of the, the face and the body, so you can display them alongside each other quite easily if you would like. Like I said, roughly the same articulation as the other figure, but kind of a neat just uh, variant, and a variant that makes sense, a variant that seems like it will show up in the storyline. I haven't seen it yet, but I would assume that it will have bearing on the episodes from the show. So great to have that kind of thing. You know, again, you got two Usagis in a line. Uh, that's that's pretty remarkable. So, uh, and you know, it's fun to see ones, you know, that make sense. And, and even if it's not on the show, it seems like something that could be in that world. And he ties in with the other turtle figures that are also in their samurai armor that we will also take a look at later in Usagi week here. So. Great little figure, uh, and as I said, out in stores now, you can find him, but you know, make sure, like I said, he's not on the back of the package, so everyone might not know that he exists out there, so keep your eye out for him. Thank you so much for watching. We'll be back with so much more Samurai Rabbit goodness here on Usagi Week here on AFI. Thanks for watching.